I've just realized there's a lot of red in this. That pillow as well is from Typo and that's from Sassam Bell, I believe. And then this is just a Zara top. Um, but I hope you guys are doing well this morning or this evening or this afternoon. Whenever you happen to be watching this, just sat down with my breakfast. Yes, in a star bowl, because all our other bowls are either due to be put away or to be washed. So we're going for a festive bowl this morning, um, which is actually quite fitting actually, because we are going to be putting up our Christmas tree either this morning or this afternoon, um, whenever Guy can fit it in. But yesterday I, me and Amy went live on Instagram and TikTok and put up our Christmas trees. Jess got involved with Amy's as well. And that was really fun actually, I quite enjoyed it. I was really relaxed, but I think that's because Jess and Amy were on the other side. If I was just by myself, I think I'd be crapping it uh, quite significantly. But yes, today we're going to get the other one up, which is literally just opposite me as we speak. I think I need to move, hang on, let me show you. So I think I need to move this and this lamp so this can get here. Um, it's a little six foot job, so I think it will probably come up to where this lamp is. Um, and this, we're thinking about putting next to Guy's desk. Sorry, I'm literally just sat amongst so much random turd. This is all our like baubles for this tree, um, and other like random baubles and the Brussels sprout. Oh my God, I don't know if I told you, but basically, literally five or ten minutes before i went live with amy anything that could have gone wrong went wrong okay right i had the ice cube tray i've got this ice cube tray that has like it, it creates spheres rather than cubes and uh it, to be fair it isn't as flimsy as i'd like it to be but i was trying to like break them out so i was trying to get the spheres out it just snapped so one half is just completely snapped in half. Oh, I went, I had like my cup in this bit. I had my cup here. I had some crisps here. And I was, I was going to pick up the tray of baubles that I think I might have showed you earlier. I was just going to pick it up and like the plastic slipped out of my hand and literally all the baubles fell all over the floor. And that meant that one of my Percy pigs died. Um, these are so cute, aren't they? They came, they came in a free pack last year uh, from Marks and Spencers. I believe they're doing some again this year, but they're not exactly the same as last year's. So unfortunately, we've only got two Percy Pigs now. But this one's looking a little bit scratched. I don't know if you can see him. Like his face is just a little bit, just like a little bit wrong there. But the other one's really perfect. And as you saw, a quick pan of my Christmas tree. Uh, I hope you guys did enjoy that little shot. I was actually really impressed with myself. I won't lie to you. It's on at the minute as well. I just put it on this morning. So I can just like sit and edit away this afternoon. And just feel festy and cosy and nice. I'm going to get a little cup of tea or maybe a little iced latte. Um, I've really been enjoying my arse last my, I keep doing it. So basically, when me and the girls went to Abu Dhabi early in the year, we all got like, basically all of us got iced lattes. Um, and I really got into it. About midway through the week, I really enjoyed them. And I asked the poor waiter if I could get an arse lighter instead of an iced latte. My brain just wasn't working that morning. Well, most mornings it wasn't working because like, <laughs> the time difference and my brain was just a bit fucked <laughs> but um yes i've really been getting into them and i'll have like a little syrup with it as well so i think i've got caramel syrups at the minute maybe i'll show you me making them because it feels just so aesthetic and i love putting a bit of time into my drink and it just tastes really lovely uh the only thing is obviously my ice cubes are all fucked because i broke my ice tray so I'm gonna have to have square ice instead of sphere ice, which is such a first world problem. <laughs> the plan of action today is literally to get that tree up. Um, and I'm also going to be filming um, two lots of makeup videos for you guys on here, um, which you'll see at some point during the next couple of weeks or week, whenever I decide to put it live. And I have got a lot of editing to do. So I've got like two videos already filmed, but I need to edit. Um, and then these other two videos as well that I need to edit, so I need to edit four. And I'm trying to think of like other videos as well that you guys might enjoy. Um, so do let me know down below if there's anything in particular that you'd like to see from me. And I can get straight on to it. Don't you worry, don't you worry, I can get on to it. I'm now going to watch my Gilmore Girls. I'm on season two, episode three. It's red light on the wedding night. And I'm absolutely loving it. I've already seen Gilmore Girls. I saw it last year. And that, that was the first time I ever saw it. It's in 2006. So... 
does that mean it finished in 2006 or does that mean it started because i think there's like four five seasons i think there's five seasons also i love it when it rains and i'm sat here because it smacks against the skylights and it just feels so cute and cozy and i love it i did try and get like a little clip this morning of like the sounds but i didn't think anyone would really be able to hear that I don't know if you can hear that either. But yeah, I'm going to watch my girl, my girls, going to have my breakfast, and then I'm going to get cracking with the makeup videos, which I need this for. the majority of the bits that I wanted to film earlier look it looks so festive I absolutely love it it's yes so I filmed everything that I kind of want to so I've now really got to get my ass going with editing so that's what I'm going to be doing this afternoon I'm going to do the treat a little bit later guy's quite busy with work like a thumbnail he's a thumbnail girly um for this youtuber and he's quite busy there's like a new uh, pokemon game that's out and it's very very busy there's a lot going on um so i'm leaving him to it i think i'll get the christmas tree up for him a little bit later so we can watch it and be quite cute and cozy and just like and then he can be like me and just kind of like look at it every now and again and go yeah that's the christmas tree feeling festive you know <laughs> I have made the tremendous mistake of thinking that I had enough lights. I do not. I don't know what one I've got for downstairs light-wise. I don't think I... I think maybe a 100. So I think I'm going to try and get a 200 pack. Um, and I'm going to get some dinner as well from there. I've just come back and I've got the 200, 200 warm string lights. And then I also found... Look, I absolutely hate these little... What are they called? Sorry. Go. What? Nutcrackers. Nutcrackers, that's it. I normally hate nutcrackers, but I was kind of like, you know what? It's Christmas, I'll allow one. So I've got that on the, for the tree. And then I've also got hanging candy canes. The ones that I bought from um, Emzo's the other day, they don't have any like hangings. So they're kind of just like placed in the tree. So if there's any movement, they're gonna fall. So I've got these ones that I've it's gonna be placed nicely and i got this little bobby brown um lipstick as well that i got from the other day when i went to the event it hasn't got a string so i'm gonna see how that's going to mount to the tree but yes very exciting let's go I do, I love it mate, I think you've done a fantastic job. You feel festive now? Uh, no, I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I need more baubles than that. I don't no, like I think that's perfect mate, honestly. Do that, you reckon? Don't, yeah, that looks very well balanced, don't go any, any further. Otherwise you'll never do it. Yeah. I think that looks very, really good as it is. Here's the Christmas tree a little bit closer up. How sick!
hello it's very blue because my um computer screens are all on um but i am just having a plan for tomorrow so me and guy are actually going to be heading to london tomorrow morning quite early i'm gonna try and get there as early as possible because i'm gonna be doing my christmas shoot um it's so much easier when me and guy just go together because then it's just me he's shooting for me sometimes he does get a little bit bored bless him and he's like i want to go home but it's going to be so fun because we're going to be able to see all the um, like Christmas lights and all the decorations as well. And it's going to make me so festive. Hopefully it will get him into the spirit as well. We'll see. But I have literally been on people's stories and location tags and posts all evening trying to find like shoots and like the streets that people go down. To be fair, Maria did tell me the other day like some prime locations. So I'm so, so excited. Um, they've got some sick displays on. Like because I'm not local to London, I think I just, I get more excited about it. Whereas um, other people that like live in London are a bit like, yeah, the decorations are up. And I'm like, the decorations are up. Excuse me, the decorations are up. I'm planning my outfits. I'm having a bit of a melt about my outfits. I don't know what to wear against all these beautiful decorations. I feel like everything will just be inferior, um, which is fine. I don't mind being inferior to some of these decorations today that for free. Yeah, I've never shot down there before. This is my first Christmas shoot. Um, and I really hope it goes well. I said to Guy to reward him for, for all the greatness that he will do for me tomorrow. He's going to get as easy out of me. So I have got a um, like ambassador card that runs out next month, actually. It's going to work really hard for me in the morning. And then I'll treat him for a nice easy lunch <laughs> before we then head back home. So I've literally got this mound here. These are coats, like colourful coats, which I'm thinking could go against X background. I actually packed these last week for potential shooting last week when I was in London. So these are the coats. These are potential outfits. I'm going to dig them out and see. And Basically, I'm trying to like strategize and I think I'm gonna need to do it in shifts so I think I'll have to like maybe get a suitcase or like massive tote bag or one location I'll bring one bag then we'll like head back to the car and then we'll go to the next location because um, otherwise I'm going to be bringing the biggest suitcase you've ever seen in your entire life we'll see <laughs> 